More now on the truck that plowed into a crowd in Fullerton last night. It happened as several clubs and bars were closing on Santa Fe Street. Yeah, the Toyota Tacoma struck nine people. No one was killed, but several people, they suffered life-threatening injuries. KCAL 9's Adriana Weingold spoke with witnesses and has video shot as all of that chaos unfolded. Well, you can imagine just how crowded this area would be on a Saturday night. It was about 1:45 in the morning. Last call at the many bars along this strip, when hundreds of people were out here. Some of them waiting for Ubers when an out-of-control truck plowed right into them. Cell phone video captured the chaos just moments after a red pickup truck plowed through a crowd of people. You could hear the screaming as law enforcement runs through the crowd to help the injured. Dustin Broy watched as a red pickup truck flew down Santa Fe Avenue and careened right into a group of people. They just crashed. There's a lot of people right here, and you know, I'm sure they were drunk. So the way they were driving, and you know, they just they hit the pole right there. So they just you know had no regard for anyone's safety. Broy says the truck was out of control as it raced down Santa Fe Avenue, hitting several cars before jumping a curb and running over people. It came to rest after crashing into a tree, pinning several people underneath the truck. Amanda Aguilar was just leaving the Continental Room when she saw the accident. I saw a, a girl that was literally underneath the truck, like the truck took her underneath and they were trying to pull her out. She says the truck was going so fast it seemed to come out of nowhere. Aguilar ran to help but says police were already there. She stopped to take a woman's pulse then stepped aside for paramedics. I just like wanted to stay in the car but I felt like I had to get out and do something to, to help because I knew there was a lot of people that got hurt and everybody was like running around like going crazy. Nine people raging in age from 18 to 49 were taken to the hospital. We are still waiting for an update on their condition, but we will bring you the very latest as it becomes available. In Fullerton, Adriana Weingold, KCAL 9 News.